So, hey, saints, it's Sister with a Testimony. I wanted to give you a follow-up um, on this uh, worship flag, this worship banner that my friend Toby Davis, a prophetic artist friend of mine, um, really put together for me. She she worked hard on it, and I know that she heard from the Lord because she literally heard my heart when she made uh, this beautiful piece of artwork. This is um, a silk flag. It's a worship banner. Uh, when the Lord says to lift up a standard against the enemy, he's talking about a banner, a praise flag, uh, you know, significant of um, the tribe that you're from, what your calling is, who you are. And uh, this really represents me well. Um, I was out in the yard one day and um, the Lord helped me to find this Coke bottle. It's... Um, partially clean on one side and the other half of it it is totally and completely um just dirty it's <laughs> yeah it's kind of interesting but I, as i looked on the ground um which this bottle right here that sister toby put in my flag it um represents that journey that I've been on with the Lord. I've been in the wilderness alone with him, uh, not in a place of um, chastisement or anything, but kind of like uh, when the Spirit led Jesus into the wilderness to find himself and what is, uh, if he was really going to be able to handle it. Um, he was tempted and tested and he, he, passed the, he passed the mustard saints, the mustard, the mustard, whatever you want to call it. But um, as I was um, in that wilderness walking and praying, I found a beautiful uh, green tinted vintage bottle, um, of course, the Coca-Cola bottle. And um, if you hold it in the light just right, you'll see the Coca-Cola insignia still on it. But um, unless you hold it in the light just right, you can't see what it used to be. It's kind of cool. Kind of like us. You can't really see what it used to be because it's too busy being what it is now praise the Lord. So through many tears and storms and winds of change and shakings, I never lost my praise and I never lost my fire. The fire's gotten hotter and the more grief that flows into that bottle of rewards, the more fire comes out, saints. The more praise comes out, saints. The more fire comes out, saints. The more praise comes out. See those beautiful notes of worship? The tears are worship. Those tears just happen, not by accident to be falling on the harvest. And I'll tell you what, saints, when you come over here and you see the generations and the souls, the hidden treasures, joy, hope, anointings, holiness, without which no man shall see the Lord, all coming from these Whew, rewards that the Lord gives each of us, gifts, and the glory of Yahuwah. And there's even more rewards that we don't even know about that that fire is producing. Those fire tears are producing. Those tears of grieving for lost souls. I had one girl say she's seen chief. But again, being the one that's been through all this, I know with what grief those tears have been shed. And I rely on the chief, the commander in chief, to decide what rewards will come forth. I can't do it, only he can. But I believe, as Sister Toby named this, hidden treasures, 
I waited that four months, saints. I went and picked this flag up about four months ago. And worshiping the other day, the Lord revealed to me that this is my harvest flag. <laughs> this is my banner. This is my banner. This who this is who I am. I'm seeking out those hidden treasures in secret places through many tears of grief. But my tears of joy will come in the morning, even through the storms of life and the winds and the shakings and all of the stuff that we have to go through, saints. It's going to determine our harvest, whether we receive the good stuff or the bad stuff. So whatever your harvest is, pray that the Lord of the harvest will send laborers so that the generations and the souls the hidden treasures and secret places can be revealed that our joy and our hope and our anointings the holiness that we live in the rewards that he's giving us the gifts and his glory to be one even as he and the Lord Father God are one he has given us the glory that we might be one even as they are one so, saints, I just want to say, sister with a testimony, this is my banner. It's who I am. And my sister Toby caught the vision, and she made it a reality for me to look at. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Father God. To you alone belongs all the glory. And even this flame looks like someone standing there with their arms lifted twofold arms lifted worshiping the lord and out of that flame another flame standing and looking that direction worshiping the lord fire <laughs> fire Woo, hallelujah to the lamb of god through the storms of life saints keep your worship banner up through the winds through the shakings through all of it keep your worship going keep your worship going keep your worship going and through the storms the great notes of worship and praise and adoration even in the grief time all those tears are being saved up by the Lord and I promise you according to the word of God your harvest will come forth the hidden treasures and secret places are yours for the asking let your groanings let your tears not be in vain saints God bless you I love you it's sister with a testimony. Get ready for the shaking, saints. Stay with him in your praise and your worship. Hold those arms up. Lift up a praise to him. And your rewards. Wow. God bless you. I love you. It's Sister with a Testimony.